Are you ready for fourth grade math? Well, here are some skills you should have learned in third grade. You need to represent and solve problems involving multiplication and division, understand multiply and divide are inverse operations of each other. Five groups of seven is equal to five times seven, and that 56 divided by eight represents 56 items in eight groups or in groups of eight. You need to understand the commutative, associative, and distributive properties of multiplication. And you need to multiply and divide within 100. You have to have the 0 to 10 facts memorized, really memorized. You need to know that 9 times 6 is equal to 54 just as quickly as you know that 2 plus 2 is 4. You need to solve problems involving the four operations, addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, and identify and explain patterns in arithmetic. You need to understand how to use place value and properties of operations to perform multi-digit arithmetic. Fluently add and subtract within 1,000. That means regroup, doesn't it? Understand addition and subtraction as inverse operations. You need to understand fractions as numbers and as part of a whole. Unit fractions, fractions on a number line, compare by reasoning about their size. You know that a half is more than a fourth. You need to solve problems involving measurement and intervals of time, liquid volumes, and masses of objects. To tell time to the minute, add and subtract time in minutes, and have a basic understanding of grams, kilograms, and liters. You need to represent and interpret data from picture graphs, tally tables, and frequency tables. You need to understand concepts of area and relate area to multiplication and addition, like we did with arrays. You need to know unit squares and length times width to find area. You need to recognize perimeter of a 2D figure and distinguish between linear and area measures. That means between perimeter and area measures. Do you know the perimeters of polygons and how to find them? Or what a side length is? You need to know your shapes and their attributes. Triangles have three sides, quadrilaterals have four, etc. Identify a triangle, quadrilateral, square, rectangle, rhombus, trapezoid, pentagon, hexagon, octagon. And if you think that you were able to learn this in third grade math and remember a lot of it, well then welcome to fourth grade math.